Continue to do what is right. That's the only way you're gonna make it through the gates and into paradise. So live a good life. Stay on the righteous side. That's the only way we gonna make it through That's the gates. That's right. And Positive music. Marley side. Palmer joins me on the set live. The man from Matura. <laughs> oh, you mean inspiration? Yes, I. Respect, man. Respect, man. Yes. I know you would have dabbled um, in lots of different genres, you know, Calypso, you know, obviously. Well, that's a reggae that we're going to talk about yeah. right now. Suka but Parang. Suka Parang. Yes. You know, you're all wrong. You got crazy, man. All wrong, all yeah, wrong, yeah. a man of music. And you said your dad also uh, would have been a very influential in, yes, in yes. giving you that, that musical foundation. Walk me, through, walk me through the early days. All right, well, the early days, well, um, my dad is a is a fan of, of conscious music, you know, a fan of, of Bob Marley. And he said, well, the first son he make, he will call him. Marley, <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I said, hey, whatever. I say, Marley, I know it had to have some kind yeah, of yeah. So he always had this conscious way, he will play, yeah. you know, Bob Marley throughout the house and, you know, different other old school vibes, you know. Mm -hmm. So that is where the inspiration really came from. And he's a positive dude as well, very spiritual, you know, always, when I reason with him, on a day-to-day -day basis, you know, he always had this spiritual way about him, and he, he's the one who said, well, you know, he get the vision, he get the yeah. dream, yeah. you know, he get a dream, a vision that, you know, going, um, the cemetery is the judging point, you know, and there are things there that the naked eye wouldn't see, you know, big, big gates, you know, big gates, and souls there in prison, in mm. prison, you know, and people who do wrong in this life, you know, they will remain there. In, in the jails, you know, and those who did good, they will go to that sunny side, you yeah, know, so there's heaven and there's hell, yeah. you know what I mean? That's really how we live and how we, mm -hmm. uh, we chart the course of the journey called life. Life, yeah. What's the actual name of the song? Live a good life. Live a good life. Yeah. And who did the production? Talk to me about the production. Ah, the right. production was done by GMS Studios, that is um, Gideon Bishop and the team, yeah, big respect to he and his party of musicians. Yeah. Where's that studio located? Um, south. South? Yeah, but how I did it is, he sent me, he said, well, Palmer boy, all right, this rhythm is the quality, the, um, the good vibration rhythm, mm. all right? So with the likes of Collis Durante on it, um, I, I dominant as well on the rhythm, and me, myself. Mm. So he sent me the beat, he said, Palmer boy, really, why on this rhythm, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he sent the rhythm to me, I, Gone by Mill Beats, big up to Mill Beats production. Okay, okay. Yeah, so I did the, the music or the recording by Mill Beats. The vocals? Yeah, the vocals. So I didn't go to the actual studio itself. The studio, the, the music itself from the studio, it sounds to me they are live instruments. It sounds like some live percussions and stuff up inside there. Yeah. To give it that authentic sound. And obviously, you did a music video for it also. Who did this uh, video production for you? All right, well, the, the video production was done by David Allen. Mm. Yeah. Did he come up with the storyboard or you decided to, you know, do that storyboard being in nature, wearing the clothes, the white, uh, giving that kind of, that, that almost biblical kind of feel to it, as it were? Oh, all right, well, presently I'm working on a 10-track album mm. entitled Reflection of Jehovah. Mm. So, with this song, Live a Good Life, um, I say, well, yeah, had a, you know, representation of the man, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All white. All white, yeah. You know? I recognize, I mean, it was very intentional. I recognize it was a, a particular feel and look you were going for. Uh, let's take in a little bit, some, let's take in some more of the video there, Tim, uh, and let's just get a true understanding as to what Marley's bringing to the table via his message. It's positive music. Enjoy. See, that's the only way you're gonna make it through the gates and into paradise, into paradise. Live a good life, stay on the righteous side. See, that's the only way you're gonna make it through the gates and end up on the sunny side. You can run from man, you cannot run from God. 
Every single thing that you do, you're gonna have to pay for it all for true. There is a way that seems right unto man, but in the end there of his destruction. So all who continue making innocent blood run, soon as you die, you're gonna face starvation. Man of the man of the running hand too, you know. I, I see the running on. Where can I run, man? A big big branch. <laughs> Where's my tour? Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> big big branch, man. What's that? I love it, man. I love it. I Remember recognize too. That's a kind of band you're trying to put together. Yes, I'm trying to put together my own band. I'm entitled the One Love Generation. One Love you know, Generation. Respect to man like Ruth Venn, um, Showin Gray, mm -hmm. um, Terrence Silly, Damian Preston. You know, a lot of those guys, man. Let me ask you, and this is a real, real, real conversation, and of course a real, real moment here, because it's, to me, as important as music and, and the concept of music, there must be the balance. So at the end of the day, yes, we find ourselves in a time where people are going in a particular direction uh, musically, and sometimes you wonder if the songs with the message, if there's a space, uh, what continues to give you the motivation, despite all what sometimes might be popular. And the, mm -hmm. and the, hmm, we, we know what a lot of people are, are drawn to, but I'm happy to see you still putting out something that's different. It's going a different direction. You're not going down the road of just the popular music and to create a rear and a forward. Talk to me about that conscious decision you've made to, to do positive music. All right. Um, I would say to myself, when you have that mantle of music or the universe chose you to do this job, this job is a very important job to inspire, to motivate. Um, I would say to musicians to continue doing what is right, continue to be positive because you don't know who you're, you're inspiring. You know, you will be in a crowd singing in front of a whole set of audience, our audience. Mm -hmm. And a man in the audience, he started to go and drink poison. You know, and you bringing that positive music or that, that message could change that man's life, mm -hmm. you know? And that's just it. Yeah, and you know, if you if you if you help one, you help two, you you, you help five, you help thousands, millions. It's mm -hmm. it's still something that you would have done via your work, and you would have inspired. Inspired, so yeah. You're making a difference. How can folks contact you? And and you know, are people going to deal with you directly if they want to deal with the bookings, or is there like a management team around you? Well, um, right now, do have a manager at the time, but well, they could contact Carla. Mm. Um, my number is 706-1570-476-1570. Um, um, Instagram, Palma Mali. Facebook, Mali Palma. <laughs> <laughs> Why switch it up? I guess it was going already, the, um, the name. Well, on, um, on Instagram, they make it that way. They switch the they names. Switch Even though I put Mali Palma, yeah. it's coming back Palma Mali. So <laughs> Yeah, I guess, I guess. The yeah. Popular Mali is the last name now. Yeah. Yeah, crazy. Yeah, Palma Mali. Crazy. But any message, anything you want to say as we to wrap things up, uh, any closing remarks to Trinidad and Tobago? Well, um, Trinidad and Tobago and the wider world, um, I will take this verse from Ephesians 6, 12, which states, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against spiritual wickedness in high and low places. We just have to be in tune with God, you know? We have to be in tune with him because the battle is more than what you can see, more than the physical. It's a spiritual battle. Um, darkness is trying to conquer light. You know, when we look and we, you know, we search and we watch around, you know? Mankind's heart has become so wax cool, you know? There is no love. Where are, the, where are the builders? Where are the, the ones to console? 
We are the ones to help. Where are they? You know? Where are these people? Where are the lights? Let there be more lights. You know, let there be more light over the darkness. All right? So the man who taking the gun to go and shoot somebody right now, the one who is pondering evil, the one who is not living as righteous, let's just try to be more in tune with God, more in tune with the divine. All right? Respect. Mali Palmer. Yes, respect, man. Respect, I. The man from Atura. Yes, the man now lay out for me the entire, the village after village after village to get uh, to a ball, you know. I really need to get a little more familiar with the space. Yeah. Um, I want to thank you for your presence and for, for your words and for your music and inspiration. With that, we're going to make our exit. Have yourselves a great day, an even better weekend. God spare and back for more next week, right here. Fire the morning brew with the truly amazing team here at CNC3. Have a great one. Until then, we out. It is the same in the spiritual. If you continue to do wrong, you're going to stay in a spiritual prison. So many say when you're dead, you're done. Soon as you die, your judgment gonna come. You're gonna have to pay for all that you have done. As you die, life has just begun. Hey, so live a good life. Continue to do what is right. See, that's the only way. You're gonna make it through the gates and into paradise. Into paradise. Live a good life. Stay on the right.